How Auctions Control Phototropism and Gravitropism by kscience.com. I'm now going to explain how phototropism is controlled by auxins. So in the tip of a shoot is where you find auxins. Auxins are a hormone. So as you can see here, I'm drawing dots that represent auxins and they exist in the tips of the shoots. The auxins are going to move down the shoot. They move down the shoot to the shaded region of the shoot. I've now added a light source, so I'm now going to explain how the shoot is going to bend towards the light because of auxins. The auxins are going to move down the plant, but they're going to move to the shaded region. So I've shown here that they're moving to the shaded region of the shoot. Now the auxins have accumulated in the shaded region of the shoot. The auxins are going to cause the cells in the shaded region, because that's where the auxins are, to grow quicker. So these cells are going to elongate more quickly. So the auxins are going to cause the plant cells to elongate more quickly. So the rear side of the shoot, its cells are going to grow more quickly. And where there are no auxins, they're going to grow more slowly. So as you can see, this is going to cause a bending of the shoot towards the light. The faster that one side of the shoot will grow will mean that the shoot is going to bend more towards the light. So in summary, auxins move to the shaded region of the shoot. Auxins cause cell elongation to happen more quickly. The shoot now bends towards the light because cells in the shaded region elongate quicker than the non-shaded region. So the shoot bends towards the light. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. When a seed germinates, the shoot where the leaves are needs to grow upwards towards light, but the roots need to grow downwards towards moisture and minerals. So gravitropism is when auxins are going to fall to the bottom of the root due to gravity. So the auxins are going to fall to the bottom of the root due to gravity. And auxins in the root inhibit cell elongation whereas auxins in the shoot stimulate cell elongation, auxins in the root do the opposite, they inhibit cell elongation. So where there are auxins, the cells are not going to elongate as quickly as where there are no auxins. So where there are no auxins in the root, the cells are going to elongate more quickly and bend downwards. So the root bends downwards to anchor the plant and reach moisture underground. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Visit kscience.com for more free videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com and don't forget to like and subscribe.